Hey guys, so I wanted to make a quick video for Christians out here that are um, trying to minister and um, basically trying to spread the word of God and his teachings, um, whether it's to... Um, whether it's with friends or family or, you know, children, you know, whoever. Um, I wanted to read this scripture really quick and um, just um, pretty much stress the importance of, um, of applying this when you minister to someone. So this is um, 1 Corinthians chapter 8 and, um, hang on, just give me one second. Okay, nope, I'm on the wrong spot. Um, okay, so... Wow, I lost my place. Um, but basically, somewhere in Corinthians, um, it just talks about, um, you know, he pretty much says that if I, you know, um, pretty much when you go out and you minister and, um, but you don't have love in your heart, you don't have, um, Um, you don't have actual love. What, oh, okay, here it is. Um, okay, so it's 1 Corinthians chapter 13. And it says, Though I speak with the tongues of, man, of men and of angels and have not charity, I have become a sounding brass or a tinkling cymbal. And though I have the gift of prophecy and understand all mysteries and all knowledge and though I have all faith so that I could move mountains and have not charity I am nothing and though I bestow all all my goods to feed the poor and though I give my body to be burned and have not charity it profiteth me nothing okay so um you know, there are a lot of people out here that, um, you know, they go out on the streets and they minister and they, you know, shout out scriptures and, you know, whatever else. And, um, you know, I've seen it so many times and, you know, it's, it's just, you know, where is the love? You know, where is the actual sincerity of speak talking to someone about God um about actually um you know doing it out of the love for God and you know the love for people and um you know I see that so many so much and you know it's good if you want to go out and minister and you know if you decide to go out you know, on the streets and, you know, ask people if they believe in Jesus Christ. And, you know, that's, that's cool and all, but, you know, a lot of these people do it as, I notice that a lot of us can do it out of works and, um, it's not out of a genuine heart from what I've noticed. And, that's why I really wanted to make this video and read that scripture because, you know, people can feel sincerity. You know, they can feel when you're, you know, truly being honest about something and, um, you know, you're, um, you're, you know, you're not stepping out of line when you're preaching about this stuff. You're, 
you know, you're keeping your respect for these people. Um, or you're keeping your, your respect for people, but, you know, genuinely speaking about this stuff and, um, you know, just, just pre pretty much, I notice, I feel like when I do that, you know, and I, I'm genuinely being honest, it's actually opening up a person's mind and their heart to God. And I just feel like that's what, that's the difference between just hearing somebody tell you a bunch of scriptures versus somebody that pretty much just talks to you and, you know, um, genuinely asks you and genuinely tells you, um, you know, about God and, you know, what the scriptures say. Um, it's not that a person is just automatically going to just believe it, but they're going to actually open their mind up and possibly even open their heart up to God and, um, you know, just pretty much giving God that opportunity to come into their minds and come into their hearts and, you know, play his role in, you know, you know, do his part, you know, which is, you know, to pretty much uh, guide people and, you know, open up their mind and their understanding to what is, you know, who he is and um, who they are and, um, you know, just what, I don't know, life is just about and, you know, what's, you know, actually going to, um, you know, set people free from whatever they're suffering from. Um, so yeah, I just, I really wanted to share that in this video and, um, to just, I don't know, let the, you know, let you guys know that if, you know, whenever you go minister to someone, make sure you have that in your heart and make sure it's actually coming from that place. So yeah.